An extreme runner is in a bit of trouble following an ocean voyage. The runner, Reza Bellucci, was trying to traverse the Atlantic Ocean in a structure that resembles an adult-sized hamster wheel when the U.S. Coast Guard spotted him. According to a criminal complaint, the Coast Guard found Bellucci while transiting the Atlantic Ocean 70 nautical miles off the coast of Georgia in preparation for Hurricane Franklin. The officers saw Bellucci's hydropod vessel and later deemed that Bellucci was conducting a manifestly unsafe voyage when they discovered his vessel was afloat as a result of wiring and buoys. After about three days of negotiations that included two Coast Guard cutters, knife threats, and a fake bomb, officers were able to disembark Bellucci from his makeshift vessel. Three days later, officers brought Bellucci ashore at the Coast Guard base in Miami Beach, Florida. The complaint did not mention what happened to the hydropod vessel. Bellucci is charged with obstruction of a boarding and a violation of a captain of the port order. But this isn't even the first time that Bellucci has encountered the Coast Guard in a similar homemade vessel. Bellucci, who said he learned the automobile mechanic trade as a child, attempted similar voyages in 2014, 2016, and 2021, and was served a captain of the port order in 2015 that said his vessel was found to be manifestly unsafe. The order also mentioned requirements Bellucci would need to safely travel in his vessel, including clearing future voyages with a Coast Guard officer in charge of marine inspections and employing a support vessel. According to the 2023 complaint, Bellucci did not comply with the order. So why exactly was he doing this? According to Bellucci's website, the trek across the ocean was a leg in his charitable Run with Reza mission that aimed to span three continents and was dedicated to quote, Iran, women, life, and freedom. A journey tracker on the website shows that Bellucci started in Southern California in January, ran across the country, and began the water portion of his trip in late August. A promo video for the mission shows that he planned to reach London via the hydropod vessel and continue running through Europe and the Middle East. I'm Nolan Beilstein, and this is Manufacturing Now.